Mark Tewart with Tewart's Tidbits, and today I want to talk to my automotive salespeople about demonstration drives. I want to make three quick points. Number one, do not make excuses about why people won't drive, don't want to drive, can't drive. It's all a bunch of BS. The reality is, I know that every once in a while you're going to have somebody that is just not going to drive the car. But for the most part, most of your customers, it's a large emotional decision and if they come in and they push back even a little bit, I don't care if it's an internet generated appointment, reality is everybody's an internet generated appointment today, I want you to say, Mr. Customer, there's at least three things you probably have not seen on this vehicle that I think will make a huge difference to you. And there's one thing that I love more than anything else about this car and I want to point it out to you. Follow me, you got to take a look at this. Do not accept that they're not going to drive. Be passionate and assume it and drive everybody. The more you drive, the more you sell. The second thing I want to share with you is once you're on the demo drive and the customer has taken over, once they've taken over, I want you in the first part of the, sh the drive to make sure that you're uh, doing your presentation, the selling, but once they're taking over, I want you to be quiet at that point. Um, I want you to interact based upon where they guide you to be. Why? They're kinesthetically learning that vehicle. They're touching, feeling, experiencing. And if you're bombarding them with auditory influence, they cannot do both well and they're going to shut you down because they think you're annoying or they're never going to be comfortable with the car. So when you're going to talk, do it more when you're driving and be a little bit more quiet and go by their guidance when they're driving. And the third thing is, once you get back, I do want you to ask some more assumptive questions, but lead them down the path of the sale while you're in the car. Do not be the first person to jump out of the car. Let them get out. Why? It's the most emotional peak time of the sales process. Let them stay in there and go into a logic state. It's where you want them to be. Three important parts about the demo drive on Tourt's Tidbits. Make sure you check out my website at tourt.com. Get our free newsletter. Follow me on Twitter at uh, Mark Tewart, and you can call us anytime you wish at 888-2-Tewart. Thanks a lot.